Hi, it's Chris with Implied Music, and uh, I've been practicing on the organ quite a bit in the past month or so, because I'm playing with the drummer and I have to play bass in the left hand, and melody and solo in the right, and so the organ's ideal for that. I use the Mojo 61. It's a Krumar, an Italian-made instrument. Well, I thought I'd show it to you today. <laughs> Okay, so you can't see me, but here's the Mojo 61. It's a Hammond B3 emulation. Like all Hammonds, it works on the principle of tone wheels. Uh, right now I have it in split mode, so we've got bass pedals down here in the left. I'm sending it out to um, a Neo Instruments mini vent, and that gives me that circular Leslie speaker effect. Well, that's gonna be my bass, but right now I just pushed in all these draw bars, and that means no sound from up here. Now, I don't know if you guys know how a, a B3, or really any organ for that matter works, but it's worked. it works on the idea of stops or voices. So if I hold down this G and pull out this draw bar, I get a basic sound. That's the 16-foot pipe. So it's a low note. And then this next one here is an octave to that. The organ is really the first additive synth, right? Now, what's interesting about the organ is that all of these draw bars or stops on a pipe organ add either octaves or fifths or other harmonics, thirds, even more in some organs. So this draw bar here adds a fifth above this note. Here it comes. Can you hear it? That's a standard setting right there. And uh, very often you'll hear jazz organ players doing just that. You can additionally turn on a little percussive click that takes away the upper partial. And it gives you a legato because if I'm holding a note down and go to another note, I don't get the click. But if I let go, I get legato. Legato is great because one thing that's true about the organ is it's not velocity sensitive. So if I want to change the volume, I need to put my foot down on the volume pedal and swell and then pull back. It's not unusual to swell, increase the rotation speed, decrease the rotation speed, and pull back. In fact, good organ players will always be working the draw bars. When I'm accompanying a singer in a rock band especially, if the singer is belting out their song, I'll have those upper draw bars pushed in. And when they're done, they can come out again. Typically in rock, I'll use these lower ones. Now, the upper partials, it gets crazy because remember that G? There's another octave and another fifth and another octave. Now listen to this. Maybe you can't hear it very well, but it's the major third. That means when I'm playing this one note, I'm getting a low octave, an octave above that, a fifth, an octave, a fifth, and then a major third. Every note is a major chord. And then this draw bar is not going to work if I have the click on, but there it is there. Well, I love the Mojo 61. It's got a few other voices as well. I can uh, go to a pipe organ, which I have to say is it's sort of not the, the ideal thing. I should probably. So I just turned off the mini vent. And 
it also has a combo organ, and I have to say combo organs are great. Check this out. <laughs> It's like the Vox Jaguar or maybe a Farfisa. This is actually, I think, a Farfisa. Do you hear the major third come in there? And last but not least, so uh, not a bad electric piano. Um, so we've got this one, which kind of sounds like a Rhodes. And then this one, which is kind of a whirly. And then this one. Which is clearly a clavinet. Love the clap, and then a really bad piano. Well, it's really bad with the mini bed. But there it is without. Other things that, of course, every um, good organ has, uh, vibrato and chorus, and we can turn it off and on, and then go chorus three, vibrato one, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Now, the Mojo has a Leslie built in. I just like the the mini vent a little bit better, and so I use it. We've got reverb and click controls. There's an external manual that goes along with this that you can buy. I don't have a second manual attached to it, but I could also easily attach a uh, MIDI keyboard to get the same effect. Um, great instrument, really fun to play with. Um, there, People have said over the years that they're not entirely reliable, but mine has been very Well, I hope you enjoyed the tour. Like and subscribe. Click the bell. You'll be notified when I do my videos. And I will see you next time. Mm -hmm.